guys welcome back to my channel and thank you for choosing this video so in today's video I'm gonna teach you what are the things that you need to do in order to start your YouTube channel okay so this video I think it's really important because uh, a lot of people don't know what's behind YouTube and they have some negative opinions about YouTube channel and that's because they don't know about this and I think that you should know in order for you to start your YouTube channel and a lot of people also they're scared of opening a YouTube channel because they don't even know what is going on okay so I'm gonna I'm gonna give you some tips on what to do before you start your YouTube channel okay so if you're new to my channel please don't forget to give me a thumbs up subscribe to my channel hit the bell for you can receive notifications plus share this video to friends that you know please I need to reach 3,000 subscribers at the end of this year so I hope that you can help me reach that goal so move along I think that you should know is that YouTube is totally free. You don't need to um, upgrade or right away. If you want to upgrade later on, you could definitely do so. Um, but you don't. You don't need to pay anything. Anybody can open a YouTube channel. Anybody. And when I say anybody, anybody can open a YouTube channel. You don't have to be a person that talks awesome in public or you don't need to be enthusiastic or you don't need to be a rich person or anybody can open a YouTube channel. This is really important for you to know because some some people they're like, oh, I, I don't think I should open a YouTube channel because I don't have this and this and that. Well, let me tell you, you are wrong. You are totally wrong. Anybody can open a YouTube channel. Number three, you could get paid in your YouTube channel through Google. And let me explain this a little bit. Once you reach your 1,000 subscribers plus your 4,000 watch hours in a year, you could lend Google to put commercials in your YouTube channel for you to get paid. And this is really important because some people they do this and definitely they get paid you know how hard is it that you working so hard for your channel and everything and you don't get paid no if you working if you work hard you should get paid <laughs> i hope you like that part too and what if you say oh i don't want to do this for the money okay you don't have to you don't have to do it for the money trust me you could just skip that part and continue doing videos i want you to know that you have a responsibility with your audience now once you open your YouTube channel, you need to know that once you have an audience, you need to keep up with your audience because I make a lot of mistakes in the past where I uploaded a video once a year and then I let it go and I didn't submit no more videos and then my audience was like, what happened? What, what, what happened with your videos? They were so good. Why haven't you done any more? And then I, I was lacking off. I really, really do not want you to do the same mistake. So definitely, if you have an audience, don't let them go and continue doing videos. Or you could let them know that you're gonna uh, do videos every once in a while or uh, once a week or twice a week or, or even less. So definitely talk to your audience because you don't wanna lose them because they're really valuable and they're really important for you and for your channel as well. Okay, so now you know all that information, correct? Which is really important for you to know. Now let's go to what you need in order to start your YouTube channel. First thing that you need to know is that you need to plan your content. You need to plan very well what you're going to transmit. If you're going to talk, make sure that your content is clear, plan ahead before what you're gonna talk, make an outline and everything. Like write it down or memorize it or anything. Just make a list of what you're gonna, what are you gonna talk about. Second of all is planning what are you going 
to transmit in your in your video. If you don't want to talk in your video, it's okay. You could just plan that you are going to in that video you're just gonna uh, demonstrate what you only want to show what you want to show to your audience that's it that's a plan okay third if you're going to talk correct make sure you have a clean background like a neat background for example what i have in my back is like a sheet from a, a bed sheet from my house from my bed and I didn't buy a background but if you're going to use anywhere in your house make sure it's neat it's clean it's not as organized it's, it's and it's it's well presented for your audience because people like that people like to see that you know um, so that's a really good thing that you should know the gear that you're going to use um, it doesn't matter what you use I mean if you want to buy a professional camera you could do so but you could also use your phone your iPhone phone, your iPhone, or you could use your tablet. Um, just make sure that you use the back lens, the back one, because the back one has better focus. And so your videos are gonna be showing, it's gonna show with a lot of quality. <laughs> Another thing that you should know is the lighting. It's really important for your videos to, to be bright as possible uh, because it's gonna project really well remember you are competing with somebody else sometimes yes you don't want to compete but if you want your videos to be shown you have to step ahead you know you have to make it marketable you have to make it awesome outstanding correct so so if you want people to see your videos, make sure that you have a good lighting. What if you don't have those, those soft box, correct? A, get near to a window or make sure that you have your house has a lot of lighting. Don't, don't depend on the light of your ceiling. Don't depend on that. Just make sure that you have a lot of light coming in in your house, okay? Um, but if you want to get access to the things that I'm using right now to make this video, go to my description down below and you're gonna see and you could click on there and you're gonna get directed to Amazon and you could buy those um, through me. Your audio is super important because if you are gonna have uh, a really nice video but your audio doesn't, it's not very well, probably your, your microphone is not working very well, then you should definitely don't start doing a video because people are not gonna understand it and people are gonna go to another video instead. The thumbnail is this. It's a, this is what you're going to see and catch in order for you or your audience to open that video on YouTube. So make sure that you have a pretty beautiful outstanding clean thumbnail before I, when i started doing my youtube channel i didn't know that very well about the thumbnail i was getting the ones that youtube created for me and then um i will leave those no right now everything is competition right now everything is like oh a a what you see is what people are gonna want to get access to okay so if it looks pretty if it looks presentable if it looks nice that's what people are going to click on and watch that video so that you need to keep in mind and there's things and there's ways that you could do it for free and in my next video coming up you're going I'm gonna show you what are the things that you could use for free in order to use or to create your YouTube channel and it's totally free you don't need to pay anything and if you want to pay the membership uh, later on you could do so but in the in the meantime you could do you could use it for free okay your presence your presence is really important I made mistakes on, on my other videos which I was my hair was nappy I wasn't wearing the right clothes I was showing my bra and stuff like that but no, your presence is really important because people are gonna love that. I'm gonna, they're gonna love that about you. But it's never too late to change, you know? <laughs> it applies to me. Fix your hair, put some makeup on, put some lip gloss, and start doing your video. Another thing that is really important is don't lose your audience. Once you 
have that audience. Don't lose them. Like, cheer them up. Uh, make, um, try to talk to them, you know. If they write a comment, re reply back, you know, and, and tell them thank you for, thank you for subscribing to my channel. Thank you for subscribing to that channel. Thank you for, for, for being, for following me, you know, because out of all the videos, they chose you. So try not to lose them. At the end of this video, you're gonna see people that have subscribed recently and I'm gonna put them um, on my video at the end of this video. And so if you want to appear on my next video, try to subscribe and I will put you on my next video. So, okay, thank you. <laughs> okay, don't get mad at bad comments. Don't get mad at them because everybody's gonna have an opinion about them. Just ignore it and continue. But it's also good to know what your audience is, wants something from you because um, like that you will learn, you know, what they're expecting from you. You don't have to, but at least be considerate of what your audience want from you. If they say, oh, you should make a video about this, then go ahead, just get prepared, uh, get the information, make your research and do it. You can do it, <laughs> okay? If, you, if you're if watching this video, you definitely, and, and I'm convincing you to do it, you know, give me a high five, eh? <laughs> and, um, and so I hope I'll be a motivation for you to start doing your YouTube channel, okay? So you, anybody can do a YouTube channel. If you're a preacher, if you're a singer, if you'd like to teach, if you'd like to give uh, tips, if you'd like to cook, anything, if you'd like to decorate, crafting, anything or even the young people that are sitting down and not doing anything right now in this quarantine and they're locked up and they don't know what to do start your youtube channel and do something about it you know and and don't be afraid you know and start and if you want me to be one of your supporters definitely put it put your link in my comments down below and i would definitely subscribe to your channel and i'll be your number one fan <laughs> Okay, so I like to support people and also I like people to support me as well. And also one thing that I want you to know is that not everybody is going to follow you and not everybody's gonna like your content, okay? Because there's so many contents out there and not, and not everybody has to follow you and not everybody has to like your content. Thank you for watching guys. I hope you love this video. Please don't forget to give me a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel and hit the bell notification button. Also, you can follow me on all my social media and now you can get access to my blog page called holabanaturalunica.com. If you see this video on my right hand side, click it and you can see the next following video and here is to subscribe to my channel thank you and i hope to see you on my next video